Hey, this is Josh for Retool.net, and in this video, I'm going to do a quick tip for the new direct link between Premiere Pro and SpeedGrade. Now, that tip is that if you want to do a lot of looks work on your clip, sometimes it's nice to be able to quickly shut off all those looks and go back to the original look of the clip. But if you were to apply it directly to your clip, then you have to go into each layer and remove each Lumetri effect. So if I take a color retooled effect here and I drag it directly on the layer, I'm just going to click on one like Bloom Bright's Heavy. And then if I throw that on the clip to actually come in and remove that from the clip, I have to click on the clip and go into the effects control to get rid of it. Now, if I have that going on for a lot of clips, that's going to get a little bit annoying. So one workaround is that you can use adjustment layers. But if I were to do that in the traditional way, I'd have to drag in an adjustment layer and then trim it to my clip and then duplicate it for all my other clips and trim them and then add all the crossfades to get that to line up. But there's an easier way. There's two things I could do. I could select my clips and option drag to duplicate them. And then I could throw it on the duplicate clips and work on there. Or if I want to work with an adjustment layer, I can do the same step. So again, I will just option drag and duplicate those clips. And this time I'm just going to select them all and option drag an adjustment layer. So now I have my exact edit intact with all my crossfades all set up for me. Now one thing you might want to do is just select all the clips and go to clip remove effects just in case you have something like a warp stabilizer on there there's no point in applying that to the adjustment layer so you would want to remove all video effects before you start the color correction on there so you'd hit OK there I didn't have any effects so it didn't matter and then you could come in and start applying effects either in Premiere Pro or in speed grade to your adjustment layers so again I'll just pick something from color retooled and let me just go with one of my tints and I'll go with cool shadow warm highlight and I'll just drag that onto one of my adjustment layers and then I could come in and do something else to another adjustment layer and then I can just shut off the whole layer if I want to get rid of all the color correction now another way you can make this even a little cooler is you could come and select all the pairs and hit Command-G. So I'll just select, hit Command-G, Command-G, and that's the same thing as if I went to select a pair and went to Clip and I went to Group. So that's just going to group the clips. And what that allows you to do is if you're still tweaking your edit, you can then come in and tweak it with both clips being tweaked at the same time. So if I click on the adjustment layer first, or on the clip first, it'll select both of them. And then any edits I do will apply to both and they'll be linked like that. So that's just a little bit of an extra step you can do. And of course I could take this into speed grade and play around there. So if I go to file, direct link to Adobe speed grade, hit save of course. I could come in and I could work on my adjustment layer here and I could see the effect I've already added. And of course I could add some other ones so if I come over here and I add something like cinematic one that'll change my effect and I could stack effects this way as well and then of course I'll just go to one of the clips I haven't touched and I'll just pick something really dramatic like dreams here and apply that and if I just take it back to Premiere I have all my clips with their effects on and if I just want to shut off all the color correct effects at once, I could just shut this whole layer off without having to go into each clip. So I hope you guys enjoyed that little quick tip on how to work more effectively with the new direct link workflow. Be sure to check out our new product, Color Retooled, which is a set of looks presets for Premiere Pro CC. A ton of easy presets that you can use in Premiere and Speedgrade CC to quickly edit the look of your clips. Everything from brightness and contrast to vintage effects, to things like vignettes that editors can quickly add to their clips and keep working. Also check out Relink Retooled, our conform tool for Premiere and Final Cut that will let you conform to your QuickTime media of different durations and file names than your original media. You can use it with combinations of tape name, file name, and of course you can use partial tape name and file name combined with metadata like time code and frame rate to help you relink your clips quicker and easier than ever before.